Where are we now? We're at Chicken and Pickle in Oklahoma City. So excited to be bringing you here today at Chicken and Pickle. We're in Oklahoma City. In this video, I'm gonna be giving you a tour of what it's like, what to expect, and more coming up. The first thing to know is that if you want to play pickleball here, the courts are booked almost all day and they have two options available for you. They have 10 courts at this location, both indoor and outdoor courts. And the indoor courts are fire. So, so good. But by the way, if you're new here, yo, I'm Christine Lozada with Where in the World to See All and I make travel videos every week to help you get up, get out, and go travel. So if you like to travel, consider subscribing. I play pickleball in every place I am traveling to. And today I'm in Oklahoma City and I got to meet Sean, the general manager here. He's amazing. And we got to do a couple things. First, we got a tour with him. And these indoor courts have a couple things going on. One, super high ceilings, awesome. Especially if you uh, lab to lab. But the other thing is that each court is individually fenced with a lot of space around them. You might see that a lot in indoor play where there's just not enough room with indoor fencing. Here you got tons of room. The other thing, the air conditioning. Yo, it's I'm literally melting outside right now. It is really hot. And so the air conditioning inside is super awesome. The other thing is that you can spend all day here, all day. They are an amazing restaurant and bar and you get full service. So when you're on the courts, you have waiters and waitresses coming around to serve you. But this is one thing that I think is so cool. When you order, if you choose to go up to the counter and order, they have a humongous space and in the coop, you can go in and order at the bar or at the counter and your tag that you have has an RFID in it. So no matter where you go on the property, a waiter or waitress or server will be able to find you and bring you your food and beverage. I think that's super cool. Whether you wanna to go to the pickleball courts or you wanna hang out, they also have ping pong, bocce ball, all the things. I think that's really neat. Which by the way, if you're getting some value out of this video, cheers that like button, consider subscribing. There's a full blog post that goes with it. So check that out in the description below as well as tons of other places to play. I've been on 43 courts just this year alone. We're only halfway through the year. Um, but if you go into the chicken coop, the thing you gotta order, and I had an opportunity to play pickleball with Mike. He's at the Texas location of Chicken Pickle. We played together on a cruise. You can see that in the blog post below. But he recommended that I get the rotisserie chicken and oh, it really is good. I got it on top of their Cobb salad. Soup very delicious. The food here really is good. I highly recommend the street corn. Get the street corn, ask them to take it off the cob for you so you know you don't have all that stuff in your teeth. So delicious. Uh, they have a great cocktail list and what's cool is that outside there's also a tiki bar. They have just a really fun vibe, um, but grab a cocktail. They have so many great cocktails on the list. In general, a must visit. Whether you play pickleball or not, come check it out. Chicken and Pickle's awesome. And which part of Chicken and Pickle are we starting in right now? Yeah, so this is like our main dining area. Mm -hmm. um, we have our big main bar right here. So we actually have four bars on property. Um, this is the one that will staff, you know, um, all day long. But yeah, we have our, you know, big main bar. Uh, it is a full service bar, so we've got, yeah. you know, all of our signature cocktails. But if you want to... Popular drink. Ooh. Most popular drink. Of our signature cocktails, probably our sparkling strawberry lemonade right oh, now. Oh, yeah, I saw that on the menu. Yeah. We were peeking at the cocktail list. That's that one or our naughty cherry. Mm -hmm. has been, it's like, a, it's like an alcoholic cherry limeade. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. What's your most popular thing on the menu? I think either our half rotisserie chicken or yeah. pickled chicken. Pickled chicken's like a grilled chicken sandwich, has yeah. pickle slaw, smashed avocado. I did not like avocado really before yeah. I started working here. Now I put it on everything. <laughs> Just kind of like our main dining area. Um, mm -hmm. It's all kind of like self-service. So yeah. you're going to go up to the cashier, you're going to order your food. Mm -hmm. uh, from there, they give you like this little block number and it has a GPS in it or like a little tracker. Oh, so you can go anywhere, anywhere. You can go property. anywhere, yeah. Um, well, and funny. then it'll show up on our screen over there. Yeah. And then we have food runners that, you know, will bring you your food. Um, That's we, cool. We always joke with people, don't don't take it home or else we know where. <laughs> <laughs> this is but, a great uh, space. Yeah, yeah. What happens in here? So this is our Be Amazing room. You know, hence the big Be Amazing sign. It's like, it's like the fun room, right? All the green couches. Yeah. And, TVs and stuff. Um, this room really, really popular for big corporate events. You know, so yeah. uh, come Christmas time, we 
put a bunch of Christmas decorations up and the big Christmas trees outside and here. And this is like, you know, Christmas uh, or holiday party central. You yeah. Know? And um, this is bar 204? Yes, yeah. So this is our Be Amazing bar. Um, apologies for the... This is kind of like where we experiment with some of our like draft beers and stuff. So we'll yeah. kind of rotate. This is like the rotate bar, you know. Neat. Uh, but again, all the bars are full service bars. So you book this space. Nine times out of ten, we'll have a bartender here, you know, so it's really yeah. easy to... Very know. cool. Yeah. yeah. All right, take us outside. What's yeah, outside? Yeah, sure. Uh, so this is the outdoor space. Yeah, so we've got like our little Argentinian grill right mm -hmm. here. Um, whenever we first opened, we really utilized this like outdoor kitchen. You Ooh. know what I want to see? Yeah. I want to see what's inside of here. Yes, the pickleball courts. <laughs> Show me. Courts. Yeah. Show me, I'm ready. Make our way, because we have our outdoor courts as well. I know. Yeah. So I, there's outdoor courts, and then these, actually, this is completely indoor. Do you guys ever open up, open it, like open the windows and stuff? Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, but with Oklahoma being so hot, yeah. you know, it, there's like a very sweet spot of like, you know, two weeks out of the year. <laughs> that, <laughs> so it's like, all right, we get to open up the windows. Yeah. You know? But all the windows in our restaurant, like um, the ones over there, those can all slide open. So it's really nice in, in the Be Amazing room too. Yeah. Uh, when the weather's perfect, it is great to like have the whole property really open. We have uh, like three entrances to the property. Um, our main entrance is probably the one y'all came through. Yeah. And then this is the one, you know, it's kind of like overflow, but if people have been here before, they know they're going oh straight gosh, to the courts. Cute. You know, they kind of come through this area. The air conditioning. Pretty neat, yeah. And it stays nice and cool here. You know. This is awesome. Oh yeah. my gosh. That means if I wanted to play today, I need to make friends, huh? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, so yeah, we have uh, the six indoor courts. Yeah. Um, different pricing, you know, for the uh, the hours during the week. I saw so, that, yeah. yeah. This makes sense. Like weekend, prime time is more than... For sure, yeah. But uh, that makes sense. You come on like... Um, you know, Monday through Friday from the uh, 8 a.m. to 10 a.m. slot. Yeah. And it's really like a community of, you know, I might show up by myself, but there might be someone that I don't know. And hey, you want to pair up today? Yeah. Um, sometimes our pickleballers, you know, uh, which are the people that like will check people in, you know. Mm -hmm. uh, hey, we need a fourth. And we always encourage them. Hey, if you have nothing going on, please go play with some. Yeah. Friends. How many courts in total are here? Yeah. So we have 10 courts on property. Yeah. Um, Obviously, with the heat being so bad in the summer, the yeah. door kind of stays booked from 8 a.m. Yeah. to midnight or 11 p.m. almost every single day. That's you know? amazing. So our uh, wow. occupancy with our courts always stays high for indoor, at least. Outdoor, you know, throughout the week, if it's, yeah. I mean, it's been 100, 105 degrees. You wow. know, so, yeah. Even with the covered ones, it's too hot for some people. So. That's awesome. Are you allowed to bring your alcohol drinks in here? Oh yeah, so um, everything in here is all full service. Mm -hmm. So kind of unlike the rest of the property, we encourage you, you know, you'll go up to the front counter, yeah. order your food, and then, you know, you start a tab. The tab's open around the whole property. Oh, got it. Now, when you come in here, you paid money, you know, to be on your court. So yeah. we want you to be on your court and have fun. Mm -hmm. And we'll have a server and they'll take your food order, your drink oh, order. Cool. You don't need to leave the spot, you know. And then afterwards, you want to go hang out, play some cornhole. Yeah. If we have bands. We have bands and DJs. Uh, oh, that's super throughout cool. Throughout the week and stuff, you know, so. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah. I love how there's like a scene area. There's a ton of space around the course. Yeah. We have like plugs up here. That's cool. Awesome. All right, show us the rest of the courts. For sure. Tell us what else is here. Thank you. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, I also saw this um, this tiki bar that's over yes, there. Yes, yes. So that's like our, um, during the summer, we, it's like a pop-up bar. So yeah. you have specific drinks here that uh, you can't get anywhere else. And so they're like our tiki drinks. Oh, that's fun. Yeah, so. Um, so they have a tiki at every location or just? Yeah. Oh, cool. Yeah. And, and the shack bar will stay open past you know the the tiki season yeah um it's just you know those those signature drinks will kind of go away yeah and then we'll go to just you know whatever is selling the best right? that's awesome uh but yeah again all the beers out here summer beers you know so yeah, yeah you've got your mango cart your kona wave you know, cool. twisted tea that that kind of stuff uh but yeah this is open uh all the time during the weekends and yeah. then, uh, monday through friday from 5 p.m to close so that's awesome and what's upstairs just additional seating yeah, so upstairs on our little terrace, uh -huh. um, I say little, it's actually pretty big. Yeah. <laughs> Just a couple other fun little things to do, you know, so we have our two bocce ball courts, 
they get booked if people come in and say, hey, I want to play some pickleball today. And, you know, kind of stinks. Sometimes it's like, I'm really sorry. Everything was booked like, you know, a week, two weeks in advance, right? Yeah. So it kind of gets, you know, some people still hang out on property, get something to eat, drink, play some cornhole, watch a ball, shop, yeah. you know. That's awesome. Yeah, have some troopers out here when uh, it's really hot. And they're like, nope, I still want to play pickleball. Wow. I'm gonna come out here and still play. Oh my God, so, thank you so much for this tour. Of course. I don't want to take more of your time. No. Thank you. You are all good. Oh my God, I'm yes. so excited. Well, yeah. I know we're gonna grab something to eat. Yeah. Maybe I'll have the history chicken. Awesome. I'm actually headed to the next chicken and pickle location. I'm driving a little bit north up to Kansas. I'm headed to Wichita, the other location. Check it out in the next video. I'll see you over there. Ciao.